Good morning, everyone. It's another episode of the Daily Snap, Friday's episode. Daily Snap is the show where we pick the news. I'm your host, Varian. We'll be selecting five news articles to make it to our newsletter. And we'll be looking at the most shared articles on social media. I'm doing this to be transparent and to show you just how arbitrary it can be to pick news, good news articles. All right, let's get, let's get at it. I'm looking at the top... 20 shared articles on Facebook. Um, first one, Justice, Justice Kennedy's replacement could make it harder to fight climate change. Uh, we saw this yesterday. Uh, maybe Supreme Court rules for anti-abortion claim. Okay, that made it yesterday or two days ago. Uh, shooting report in Capital Gazette newspaper in Annapolis. A paper owned by the Baltimore Sun. So it seems that uh, there's another shooting. I hate to say this, but there's so many shootings in a year in the States that um, another shooting isn't really surprising. And it, it's a sad state of affairs, but they're not even, I, I don't see a, a quick number of how, how many people died, a killing five people. You know what? That's That sounds like an average shooting in the States. That's, I'm, I'm sorry to say that. I wish it wasn't the case. I'm sorry to the families, but um, if, there, if there's really nothing else, then maybe, but uh, yeah, it's another day in the States. Uh, France brings back national service. Uh, okay. Yeah. This made that. It made the snap before. This made the snap before. Anthony Kennedy to retire f uh, from Supreme Court. So th this is more factual instead of the time uh, definitely taking a political stance, although Climate change doesn't really seem like a stance. Justice Kennedy seems to be a big... Uh, oh, so this is the uh, Indians uh, talking about um, human rights in Kashmir. Uh, story again. McConnell Senate will vote this fall on replacement. Okay. What to do when, not if, Roe vanishes. Roe versus Wade. Uh, Huffington Post. This is an opinion piece. Um... Huffington Post is, uh, I don't think, has much editorial um, stuff behind it. Uh, so I don't know how accurate this stuff kind of stuff is. What well, the credentials of, of Rob and Marty are. Not to discredit them, I just don't know. Um, it's, uh, let's look at the, uh, <clears throat> let's look for some more articles. Protesters gathered outside Red Hen restaurant. Okay, we saw that before. Woman Trump cites Trump. Okay, more Trump news. We avoid Trump news here. R Laura Loomer confronts Maxine Waters. We saw that SJ Detona Wilder versus Anthony Joshua fight for heavyweight championship announced. This seems like entertainment news. Uh, former Fox News president uh, Bill Shine in talks with senior White House job. Interesting who resigned amid sexual harassment scandals, cable news, is in talks with it for a senior. So it's talks. It's not actual stuff happening. Um, I don't know how newsworthy it is. It really seems like a slow news day today. Uh, how China got, okay, that made it. It was a great article. Mitch Connell says uh, with a straight face that imperative that president's nominee be treated fairly. <laughs> a lot of talking, not a lot of action. Uh, where, where's, where's the actual news guys? Uh, looking at the top 20 shared articles on Reddit. <clears throat> Shooting reported at Capital Gazette newspaper. Okay. Satellite images show North Korea. Okay. So that. Well, Trump news made it before one football pitcher force. Yeah, that made it. Trump's IRS picks. Owns property at Trump's IRS hotel. Okay. It's Trump news. Trump news. <clears throat> Could be a win-win-win for UK, says Think Tank. Yeah, well, that's that's not a. This isn't news, guys. Get on it, UK. Uh, be more like Canada. Trump. Yeah, we know it. North Korea upgrades nuclear facility despite Trump. Yeah, we got it. Sources: Spurs talks to Lakers, Celtics for Kali. Sports news. Uh, this made it before. Facebook is reversing its ban on cryptocurrency ads. Made it. <clears throat> Saw that. 
I think in support in Congress after Tuesday's primaries. Okay. Um, it's all super interesting. Maxime Waters, if you want to talk about civilities, more Trump. Supreme Court rules against California law targeting anti-abortion pregnancy. Anti-abortion pregnancy. Yeah, well, this is the same thing that happened a couple days ago. Uh, anti-abortion to demonstrate outside the Supreme Court in March. Okay. The Supreme Court on Tuesday dealt a major political California law. Okay. Okay, so it's just re reiterating it with regards to California. Why women cites okay, more Trump, lower status people more likely to share wealth than higher status people. So that is not a surprise to me. <clears throat> it's it's I think it's common knowledge that um, people who don't have much know what it's like to not have much, so make a big deal of, of sharing stuff with people who don't have much. Um it's reversing its ban on cryptocurrency ads. All right, uh, let's look at the positive, everything with positive sentiment on Reddit, because it's really a slow news day. I'm not liking the news articles that are showing up today. Deadpool creator, Uncharted creator, Amy, okay, entertainment, entertainment, Be, because they're good, okay. Um, this is who, okay, uh, just people in the Democratic Party. Deadpool, Rob Krieger, Luf. I mean, the whole thing was brilliant. Okay. 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 Uh, Sean Addy accidentally made a great argument for socialism. This isn't news, guys. We need action. We need. We can't have people talking about things. We we need actual things happening. Kind of reassured. Citizens, there will be enough weed for everyone October 17th. I mean, uh, maybe. Uh, RuPaul's Drag Race Season 1 Queens reunites. Okay, entertainment news, entertainment news. Uh, okay, saw that brief. Now protests your, now protects your browsing activity with Tor powered tabs. Nice. Um, Brave seems like a really cool new browser. Uh, gotta give it up. Starbucks will now pay for all cosmetic surgeries. For okay, that made it. Niantic shows off a stunning AR demo that lets Pikachu hide behind real world objects. That you know what? Just because um, that Pokemon game, Pokemon Go, made such a big deal uh, with its AR stuff that who knows? Maybe maybe people. It's going to be another phase of everyone downloading. Pokemon stuff. Samsung adds nearly 30 new clock faces to always on display. Carl Harden is, okay. Uh, protesters across Dallas Fort Worth uh, hope rallies against immigrant separation will bring change. Uh, how many people? 1,500? That's, that's, I mean, it may seem big. Uh, we had protests over here in Montreal of like 200,000 people, and it didn't even bring change. So, um, I don't want to belittle the size of a protest. I hope it brings what you guys are asking for, but it's not that big of a protest. A Demolition Man st uh, style Taco Bell is coming to Comic Con. A Demolition Man style, okay. Uh, Netflix will make Mark Wahlberg uh, revive Robert P. Parker's Spencer with Wonderland, okay. Bernie Sanders, Sarah Sanders has the right to go into a restaurant and have a dinner. Wow, just so much talk. No action. People, we want news. We want something new. It has to be something new. Ed of charity to prevent child abuse arrested for soliciting child pornography and sex with minors. Okay, well, uh, this doesn't... Oh. Well, yeah. Is this a trusted source? Is this a trusted source? The chairman of international campaign to stop rape gender has been arrested for soliciting rape of multiple children as one young and uh, as. Uh, The 22-year-old Joel Davis was arrested in New York, allegedly 
Okay, well, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll look up his name and then try to have sex with two-year-old Metro Teen Vogue BuzzFeed. Uh, NBC News 2. Washington Post, New York. Okay, so it is real news. Yeah. So this can make it. Let's bring it up. Let's bring up the... Uh, I mean, I, I really like this, but I don't know how many people are going to care. Um, this is going to make it for sure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let, let's kill a brave because I feel like no nobody else is going to, not nobody, but few people are going to relate. Canada reassures so there'll be enough weed for everyone on October 17th. On October 17th, we're going to be there, but some people worry there won't be enough federally licensed weed shops to build. Uh, when weed becomes the other, there'll be slight difference in regulation depending on promise. We promise at least saying uh, we'll only allow people to buy weed in province run shops. Okay. Reason people are concerned might be, you know, we did blah, 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 blah. The CBC should get a health said they're, they're confident about supply without explaining how it will all pan out. <laughs> That's funny. Can they just import a country? That's that's very funny. Um, maybe, 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 maybe. <clears throat> ah, this could make it. Uh, this, this is just talk. Uh, uh, lead author to mom, uh, for the highest. This is an actual Lord's Queen Mary University of London. So this is an actual study. You know what? If it's an actual study, uh, maybe it's interesting enough. Uh, we can kill that. <clears throat> This is kind of, I'm sorry, it's not, it's not, nothing new there. Ah, no, I lost my UN article. Um, uh, I'll go find it. Um, but essentially, yeah, those are five news articles of the day. It's the head of the charity uh, to prevent, <clears throat> the chairman of the international campaign to stop rape and gender violence and conflict has been arrested for soliciting rape of multiple children. Uh, Niantic shows off a stunning AR demo that lets Pikachu hide behind real-world objects. Lower status people more likely to share wealth than higher status people. Canada reassures citizens there will be enough weed for everybody on October 17th. Um, and uh, UN reports on JK Motivated, says Bipin Rawat, talking about the Kashmir border. Uh, report by the UN. So thank you very much for today. <clears throat> I hope to see you tomorrow. Uh, sorry, Monday. And uh, let me know if you think we should have chosen uh, different news and what you thought of the news today. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Bye.